being conscious and aware of your environment. Hello and welcome to my page. My name is Gareth Fleck and in today's video, I wanna just share a little bit about being aware of yourself, your thoughts and your environment. So I'm gonna use me having a haircut and a beard, my beard shaved off is a good example. So I've been thinking about shaving my beard and I was like, oh, I don't know if I'll do it. Should I go back to just being a baby face? And then I uploaded a video. So I've been thinking about it and I uploaded a video from a year ago with me having a shaved face. And the comments were all really positive. Like you look so much better with um, you know, facial hair. Oh, you look like a spiritual teacher or um, you know, you look so good, you look clean. And I was like, oh, that's so funny because I'd been thinking about should I shave it? So my awareness and other people, you know, is reflecting back to me my own thoughts. And, you know, I must have been thinking, oh, I did look pretty good without a beard. Um, does the, the big ginger beard look a bit shabby? So I upload that video of people saying that. And then yesterday night, I went out to see all my friends. Three or four comments were about my beard. And one's like, when are you going to shave it, dude? Oh, you look so scruffy. Oh, dude, I hate how that your beard's ginger and your hair's black. Um, you know, these are all my inner thoughts. I'm, you know, I've been thinking, but they've been projected out and I'm so aware of it. Like they're speaking. I'm like, okay, that's my thoughts speaking to me right now. Um, maybe I should shave my face um, and have a haircut and get back to being clean. So I've been thinking about getting a haircut and I drove down Victoria Street where I see a guy called Woz. He um, has a, a barber shop, you know, in a van. And you park up and I drove past it last night and I was like, hmm, maybe I should go see Woz tomorrow. And get this. I got home last night and actually shaved my beard myself. And I was like, okay, I shaved it off now. I was like, I need the haircut, you know, get nice and looking nice. Um, and I was actually heading home just before. And on the side of the road in a complete different location, there's Woz. <laughs> <laughs> and there's a um, barbershop van sitting there like in the sun you know the lights are shining down I'm like okay awareness all right I know what's happening here I better pull over um and then I, I thought before I got out I was like I bet he's only going to be taking cash a little and behold you know I got up to the van I'm like sorry we just ran out of paper in the um FOS machine we're only taking cash so you know it's 35 dollars for the haircut and I just went and got 40 bucks down you know gave him 40 but it was interesting to you know, and he's like, I'm so happy to see you, you know, telling all his, because when I first met him, he worked at a mall, and I was like, you're so good, you're too good to be working for someone else, you need to work for yourself, a few years later, now he's just got his fourth truck, and his own business, portable barbershops, and he was telling all his people how, like, I was one of the first people, you know, that really helped him when he needed it, and I was like, oh, this is so beautiful, so, you know, I gave him the extra five dollars to tip it, drove home, but yeah, as being aware, you know, I had been thinking about getting my beard trim. My outer world reflected it back through people telling me, you know, you look scruffy, get a new, you shave your, your beard. Um, is that how I was feeling on the inside? So it was my inner state projected out, reflecting back at me. And you become aware and conscious of this, you know. And then I had the thought to get my hair cut to see was. And then he was in a location I'd never seen him before. And I was, I was like, okay, cool. So the way I make my videos, you know, I get up and I sit still like, God, what do you want to speak about today? Barely ever have any idea of what I'm going to speak about. Like, I like to ask you guys, so then I do if I'm like, ever feel stuck, but I just like to press play and go. And today I came to speak about being awareness and conscious of your thoughts and the match of being projected into your outer world, into your reality, because you actually start to see it and you become really aware of it. And because everyone around you is just telling you who you are, your own concept of yourself. So me thinking I look scruffy of a beard um, was reflected right at my face. And yeah, I'm aware of that and to see it. And I'm like, okay, cool. These are just my thoughts projected out, coming back to me, my insecurities or, you know, or, you know, desires. And I've been so excited about the YouTube and, you know, and all my friends now are like, YouTube's going great. It's so amazing to see, like, proud of you. Your thumbnails are on point, you know, and that's cool because I've been really enjoying it and loving it. And to see it coming projected back at me again, it's like, yes. So if you want to know where you are and how well you're doing, just look at the people around you. How are they speaking to you? What are they saying? Just be conscious and be aware.
yeah i hope that was a helpful video i love you and i will see you in the next one and as always peace be on your soul and enjoy your life <laughs>